Hey everyone, welcome back to my stream. It's been a while since we've played this game, and I figured we need to get back into this game. It's been a while, and we need to beat this boss. So come with me today for the ride. I don't know what's going to happen, I don't know if we'll be able to beat this boss, but we'll see. So let's continue the game, let's see, 7A, we're on... This one? Okay, let's do this once again. Leave the elevator. Yes. Is this the transcontinental platform? Of course it is. I told you I was taking you back home. I, I'm sorry, dear. We were too careless. This was meant to happen sooner or later, anyway. Stop. You're not taking them anywhere. I really don't have time for this. Perhaps you should have thought about that before you tried to get us killed. Listen here, you brainless loudmouth. I don't know what you might have heard about me, but I'm not someone you want to mess with. After all, my mission is not only to take care of these two pricks, but to make sure that you don't do not cause any disturbances. I thought a partner would handle that part. But he's not even good enough for that. The only time we assign a task to someone from the surface, they somehow manage to make matters even worse. But you know what? I'm getting tired. Tired of all this hassle. Good thing I wasn't expertly told to bring you guys alive after all. So you don't have to go back to the core. I'll end things right here and right now. So last time we played this, she beat our beat us, she kicked our butts and all that. So I need to keep trying, I need to beat her or something. If we can. Um let's do a skill. Let's do this she takes off a lot of health I want wait let's go skill uh no I am um, we need to make it on you. I'm not gonna let you die, man. Ah. Okay. She's been marked. Um, let's boost everybody. Boost. You'll be shooting next, but we're gonna boost you. My drones. Eliminate the traitor. Uh, I am. Let's see, we're going to be using... Uh... We're going to use a fire grenade on everybody. And then we'll use skill... On the... Drone.
We're gonna attack this drone. Okay, she healed, so that's her turn. That's fine. Uh, let's do a skill. Actually, actually, no, actually, let's do an item. We're gonna do a. Mm, we have four of those. Let's do this on you. Okay. Now we'll attack this one. Okay, I got I recovered. Good. We're gonna attack the drone. Good. Now we're gonna attack the other drone. Okay, I need to use my, let's see, I am, I need to use a med kit on myself. I can't afford to die. Attack, the drone. Um... Let's do a pipe bomb on everybody. Okay, he's blind. Evaded. Ow. Uh, let's boost you. Okay. Come to me, my Jones. I hate these Jones, you know that? Okay. Let's do a skill. Let's see. Smoke bomb on everybody. Okay, blind, blind, blind. Good to know. Okay. Let's make the map. Wait, make, let's make this good. Let's see. We'll attack this one. We're going to boost you. Attack this drone. Okay. Attack this drone. Ow. Okay, he failed. She used TO, that's fine. Okay. Attack this person, this drone. Let's use an I am actually skill. We're gonna cure myself. Actually, wait, how much does it use? Uh here's a small amount. Maybe I had can use a Maybe I can use a cocktail, but we need some cookies. What's your, what is this? It does everybody. Good. Okay, attack this one. Attack that one. 
Wait, that's dead. I don't like that. Okay, she's mocked again. Okay. Whatever. Let's do I am. Um... Oh, yeah, he can't. He doesn't like stuff like that. So let's do boost. I'm going to boost you. Just to be safe. Why should I boost it to her? Oh, well. All right, we're going to go to I am. We're going to do... I should save the smoke grenade for the next thing. I know what's going to happen. Uh... No, we're not going about that right now. Okay, she's going to die, I think, so... All right, she evaded. Wow. Okay. Before we do that, let's do an I am... We're going to... We're going to give you a fish roll. To heal. Get you back up. Attack this. Okay, and then let's see what items do we have. Well, she, we should probably get a shot. Um... Actually, no, let's do, let's just attack you. Ow. You want to do that? I will do that. Um, you'll be next. Let's do skill. Okay, she's been inflicted with blindness. That's good. Uh oh. She evaded that. Oh, not good. Good. Lynn has been defeated. Oh no. Then we can't let you die here. We're going to have to bring out the defibrillator, I think it said. This thing. Welcome back. I'm on boost you. And then we're going to attack you. Man, she keeps evading. That's not good if she's evading. Okay, let's do I am. Let's do I don't want to do any of those because it's gonna be boost. Yeah, she was just boost. You're next, but we'll boost you. Okay, you're next. 
Okay. Why do I have to waste my precious time finding a bunch of civilians who can barely handle a gun? Can't you see you're sacrificing your life for someone who's just like me? I'm not like you. Not anymore. You might think so, but you haven't stopped killing since you left the core. The smoky smell of gunpowder in the air, the metallic aftertaste of blood. They're the only things that keep you going, aren't they? You should, shouldn't feel too bad about it. It's just how you were raised. That's the only thing that stops you from coming back to your pride. Even if I was raised like this, I have changed, right? Or did I just change sides? Am I, am I still just like them? In Kalingrad, I fought against my own brothers. In Germany, I fought against Weber's men, even though they were civilians. When I lost my rifle, I didn't feel relieved. I felt like I was missing a part of myself. Am I so dumb that I can't think of any other way to solve these conflicts without resorting to force? I... They're nothing like you. Luke and Dill are taking responsible for the damage you've caused. Huh? None of this would have been necessary if the core hadn't started this pointless war. Even if they hadn't helped us in Kalingrad, they would have had to face the core sooner or later. There was never an option. It was because of them that I was able to trust people again. Rook and Adil gave us a reason to fight for. That's why we'll stand by their side. Is this supposed to make me feel better about their actions? People don't change. Stop pretending you are better than us because you made up some excuses. Enough. I don't like this, any of this. I'm ashamed of what I've done, but I can't just sit here there with my arms crossed, thinking, asking for forgiveness. I try my best not to think about it, to justify it all in my head, to pretend it wasn't me. But no matter how hard I try, I, I just can't stop seeing that poor kid's face everywhere I go. I can't stop now. There's no going back for me, much less knowing what the core is planning to do. Just how long are you going to keep us up? You cannot even survive on the surface on your own. We're the ones who made you the person you are today. Why are you sacrificing it all for them? Because ever since I got out, I've seen how they support each other. I've seen how they work together, not because it's their duty, but because they actually care. They care about me as an individual, despite all my flaws. And this is something the core never teaches us. I feel sorry for you. How come you haven't realized they're just using you? Do you really think they'll still try to fear your wish to stop this war if you died? Since you dragged them into this, you're the only hope to survive. They are staying by your side because you have what they lack. Power, and you have, and you only have that power because you're a son of the core. That's wrong. I am who I am, despite how I was raised. They don't need me. They are already stronger than me. Because of them, because of them, I haven't given up. Because of them, I am here today, and because of them, we'll be able to stop this war. There's nothing you can say to convince me. Your actions are enough to see how for shit everyone at the core is. I know people here are not perfect, but the ones by my side are a lot more than I could ever ask for. So now I'm confident I made the right decision when I left. I will tell you to think it over, but there's no more time for you or your friends. Is that so? So she's still blind, as you can see in the top left corner, so... She's about to call into Jones to help her. Okay, she can see now. Ow. Is he dead? Nope. Okay. We need to do I am. We're going to boost... Let's see, we're going to do a team med kit on everybody. Good. Let's finish this. Bye bye.
She didn't get caught for backup for Jones, I don't think. That's good. No, no, this can't be happening. I had everything under control. I... Father Jr. was going to be furious. He... I'm a raven. Ow. If I fail... No, I can't fail. I might as well be dead. I... I'm not worthy. I'm no good. I don't deserve to be part of our army. If it wasn't for Koi, he's the one who should be taking care of this. It's his fault. It's your damn fault, Koi. Sergeant, save it. I don't need your pity. My dignity is all that I have left. Tomorrow, tomorrow the Koi will be stronger than ever. Patty has learned gotcha journalism. It's it's finally over, isn't it? I think so. I'm starting to feel sick. We shouldn't stay here much longer. Yeah, that's probably for the best. Adair has joined the party. Rook has joined the party. Thanks. Adir? Hmm? I know it may not be worth giving this much thought, but do you think we could have ended up like her? I mean, if we have decided to stay at the core? Why are you bringing that up now? The sergeant was a person I really looked up to. I really thought I could change her mind, and I can't help but think that perhaps there was a solution that didn't require any of us to die. I was convinced that if I took a firm stance, I could persuade her, but apparently it only shaped her to defend her own beliefs. Rook, nothing good will ever come out of overthinking this. We are finally getting closer to our goal, and we have the strongest team on our side. Maybe it's not too late to make the core change his mind. We can still make a difference. After all, you were able to make me change my mind. Uh, yeah. I guess you are right. But what's going on? Oh, right. I forgot to tell them. We'll explain everything later. Guys, we need to leave now. Quick, everybody get on the train. I must say, I'm impressed. Knowing how to drive a train isn't very common. Yeah, 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 about that. Hurry up. We have to leave before they find a way to get inside. I'm trying, I'm trying. But this chain is different from the one from the game I play. Wait, so nobody actually knows how to drive this thing? It should be one of these operating handles, but I can't concentrate if you all keep yelling at me. Maybe if I turn the switch. It worked. But we still aren't moving. Can't you just step on the gas or something? It doesn't look like that, you know? Oh, I think I've got this. We're moving! You did it! But where are we going? I... I'm not sure. I hope everyone's okay.
Are you awake? We only have 10 minute window, so follow me quickly. What are you doing? Uh, we need those girls. What are you even trying to achieve here, Faye? I'm leaving this place for good. Don't be absurd. Operation Pergolo is starting tomorrow. And that's the reason why I'm doing this today. For months I have to watch and partake in hundreds of negotiations with politicians from all over the world who turn a blind eye to everything the core does. Exchanging people's lives for favors. Faye, we've worked so hard to make everything work out flawlessly. Stop, stop. Why aren't you listening? Haven't you seen what they're doing? These poor women don't deserve to live like this. That? That's the cost of maintaining such a large op organization. Are you ever justifying it? Listen, we can't be questioning Father General's decisions. Let go of me. Now. I won't tell anyone you let those women get away. Just come back to the base. I don't want to have to fight you. Just let me go. Bay, if you try to escape, I'll have no choice but to shoot you. Are you still going to shoot me? It's my duty to... Sergeant Coy, enter. Sir, we have news that the deserters are in Poland. We found the train that they used abandoned between Warsaw and Outer Baran stations. But there was nobody inside. We must keep searching. They can't be too far away. Cover all exits. Go, go, go. Yes, sir. Can you see an exit? I think so. There's light coming in from some steps ahead. I wonder if this ladder can really hold all six of us. Let's not think about that. Ow! Someone stepped on my hand. S sorry Guys, be quiet. I think I found the hatch. What is this place? I'm not quite sure, but my best guess is that we're in some sort of warehouse. And what do we do now? There has to be a way for us to reach the surface. They might already know we're here, though. We need to be careful. Okay. So, where are we, though? So, let's see, we're all good health. Good to know. And let's see, our party. We have those people selected. That's fine. Um, Skills. Is she? If I do that, let's see, quests. Where are we right now? I think we're in Poland. Poland shakes. John the lines. Thieves. Interesting quests. We'll figure them out, I guess, as time goes on. Can I go down? I shouldn't go there. Okay. PC, PO, distribution, and logistics center. Save your progress. Yay, we can save. Okay. So, let's save from the very top slot and work our way down. From the Jossix Department to Private 1215, third warning. 
private 1215. This is our third time this week, I have to remind you already. Make sure you sort out the crates that are blocking the warehouse aisle as soon as possible, or you'll be sent back to headquarters to wait for your punishment. Consider this your last warning. Okay, push that up. Let's push this one over. Go, let's push this one down. Okay, like that. Can I get some genuine shots, it looks like? That wasn't too hard to do. Okay. Nothing here. Needs a three digit code. Nothing here. Oh, I'm, oh, I'm glad it's an outfit and not another ladder. Wait, is it out of service? Hmm, according to this, it seems to be controlled remotely. We need to find some sort of control room to act, act reactivate or it won't be able to leave. Let's look around. It should be somewhere in this facility. Okay, progress has been saved. Let's go this way. What's this say? Facility Control Center. I mean, sure, we might as well walk in. Root, look. Here's the warehouse control room. We should be able to call the elevator from here. Oh, but what is this? It looks like we need a four digit code to open the door. Let me try something. One, 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 one. Dude, that's not gonna work. And what can we do to open it? Hmm. Hey, I know how we can get the code for the door. Do you guys know if they have some support line or something in case someone needs technical assistance? They should definitely have something like that. All right, then the only thing we need to do is contact them. There's no problem that can't be fixed with a little social engineering. Let's go find a place where we can talk to support. That's our way in. It's locked. I wish I could take a nap, but now is not the time. This is a big area. It's just a bunch of boxes, an office prize, and wait, what is this? Protein powder. Hmm, it's just a, the powder. I'll hold on to this for now. Maybe I can mix it up later. Going here. Stun grenades, good. Input your shorter ID number. Well, we don't have one. But 1215, this is on the um, email. Well, thank you, Private Pat Patrick. Logistics area key. Sir, suspicious activity has been reported at the warehouse station here in Warsaw. It seems that one of our shoulders, Private 1215, has requested access to the logistics area. But according to our records, no one should be there until tomorrow. Send a group to investigate immediately. We can't take any risks. They could be the traitors and ferry in our base. Right away, sir. Team med pack, good. Let's run down. Okay, over here. Where's the door? Right here. Okay, let's go this way. What's this? Don't know. Okay, can we go in here? The 
drawer has been unlocked. Oh, did we run all the way around? I mean, sure. Before we do that, let me go up here. It's locked. So we've been over there. I'm pretty sure. We've been all over here. Yeah, we've been all over there. Okay, let's go back in here. Go back in here. Let's see. So we need to... What's this one? Wait. Okay. We'll go there in a minute. Let's save my game once again. Are you progress? Yes. We're saving it here. Progress has been saved. Can we go in here now? The drawer has been unlocked. What's this? Don't know. There's nothing here. And we got stuff from all the other vending machines, but not that one, I guess. From the core HQ to PO distribution and logistics. Subject, new orders. New orders have been issued from the HQ. They must be implemented as soon as possible. First, any sensitive information regarding our connections and contacts in KO must be wiped immediately. Second, every chain coming from KO must be inspected. The deserters are most likely to be found in or nearby the dragons. If spotted, eliminate them. Third, Sergeant Coy from the Raven Squad will arrive by 900 hours. Every shoulder in this facility shall be available for assistance if required by the sergeant. That means they're on the way to visit us. So we have to make sure we move quick. There's nothing over here. So let's see. Can we go in here? No. Um... Before we do that, is this the warden or is this the general? So who is this old man? That old man is Father General. Hmm. So this is how he looks like. I don't think I've seen him before. He's not much of a public figure, but every time he's an in international conflict, a civil war or an opportunity to intervene, he's sitting next to all the world leaders. Still hanging a giant portrait of himself in a warehouse. I wouldn't be surprised if the walls had the core plastered with his face. Can we go, please? It's making me a bit uncomfortable. Yeah, we can go. Um, can we go? Is there a door here? Oh, there's a hallway right here. There's nothing here. I don't know how we missed it. Odd medicine. Okay. Um, can I, these books are sparkling. There's a book sticking out. Should I grab it? Yes. It's got a note inside. Congratulations, you found this note. Now put it back on the book and move on. There's nothing to see here. One, three, nine. One, three, nine. So that's, I need that code. Let me write this down if I don't forget, just in case. One, three, nine. I know where it goes to. What could this code be related to? Maybe it's the code for that locker. I should go check it out. Yes, you should. The Chance Continental Train is a state of art transportation system used by the Corps Army so our shoulders can easily reach every corner of the world. Construction of the project started when an electric and centric billionaire planned to build a new way of transportation by making holes underground, not realizing that tunnels had already been invented centuries ago. Father General Eugene Wisner reached out to the celebrity inventor, and, to get, and together they built the largest transport network known to man. Or maybe not so known, since these trains are only being used by the Corps. Okay, let's go this way. And we come... Wait. We don't want to go down the ladder, do we? 
Do we? Oh, maybe we do. <laughs> Nothing here. Wait, what's that one that we're looking for? Wait. Sorter 716 and his accomplices should be around here. Stay alert. The only way of getting through is through fighting them. Prepare first. Let's go up the ladder. And then... Wait, go down from it. Yeah, go up the ladder. We're going to go get the stuff out of this other locker. Okay. Go up here. Um, go this way. Go down this way. Which locker was it? I think it's down, down here. And it's push this out of the way. Oops. Can't push them all at one time. Nope. I'm gonna have to go back. Wait. Nope. I'm gonna have to go back and redo this. Let's go back up here. I'm pretty sure the locker's gonna be... If I remember right... Maybe the locker's in here. Let me just to double check. Um, that's that. Those are all open. Yeah, it's gonna be back that way. Okay. So instead of doing this time after time, save your progress. Yes. Save it here. Right here. The one that's not opened. Hey. It worked. FS 5.7 mm. Okay. Now I think we're ready to fight some enemies. Okay, let's go over... Actually, before we do that... Let me save my game here. Because we just... We just found that thing I want to keep opening it again, so... Save it here. Okay. Um, let's go run this down this way, go this way. Okay, let's hope we can do this. The only way is to go for fighting them. We're gonna fight them. We're gonna kung fu fight. Okay, attack. They don't have too much health, that's good, you know. Okay, attack. The one in the middle is the medic, so we should attack the medic first. Okay. Attack the one in the middle. Medics down, good to know. Attack you, you're next. Okay, you can evade all you want. We shall find a way to kill you. Okay, evaded. You're next. That's it. I mean, Okay, he's down. You left, man. I mean, not too much health taken off. That's good. And you're dead. And we're going to... 
pick the first aid kits. Here we go. But since it can't be, it can't be just three. Uh, don't call for the, that. We're gonna go in, up here. From General of the Corps, Eugene Westner, to PL Distribution and Log Logistics. Message from your journal. Soldiers of the Corps, at this time your work is of great importance. You are in charge of giving each and every man and woman participating in Operation Pergola their equipment and weapons so they can bring your army their so learned victory. I'm counting on you to meet the expectations placed upon you. And do not doubt for a minute that you have full support from your general during this important period in our history. Okay, what do you say? Sure, let's go hard for these air ducts. And then call for that one. Okay, let's see, we're gonna have to push this down. And then the only way to, but we have to push it this way. I mean, it's a huge air vent. I think I can crawl through it. Crawl through it. I want to see where it goes. Okay. Looks like a bunch of boxes of packages up there. Um, let's go for this door, I guess. Oh, all right, we're here. So what do we do? Well, you call them and you need to convince them to give you the code, you know, mani manipulate them a little. What, what, how? Look, just call them and we'll figure it out while talking to them. Don't worry about it. You'll be fine. I'll stay here to give you more support while playing for a bit on this computer, okay? Sure. Serious support here. How can I help you? Crap, I wasn't expecting them to answer this fast. I really didn't have time to think this through. Hello, I'm calling from the warehouse. I'm having trouble getting the elevator to work and... There's an emergency. I just saw an intruder getting into the elevator control room. I'm as sure as a traitor. 716. I need the code right now. Understood. May I have your ID number? There's no time for that. We can't let him escape again. No, no. Of course. Okay. Here's the code. Listen carefully, please. Delta. India. D. I. Charlie. Echo. Um, is that the right code? I need numbers. Uh, hello? They hung up. Wow, Rook. That was some convincing acting for once. It was a bit scary, honestly. Never mind that. We have the code now. Delta India Charlie Echo. Hmm. D I C E. Dice have numbers on them, so maybe. Oh, wait. You're overthinking it. I think I got it. Let's go to the keypad. G guys, wait. Before we go, I need to tell you something. What is it? Well, Rick was talking to support. I took a peek at this computer, trying to see if I could find some way to access the course network. You know, to gather some dirt we could use against them. Sadly, I didn't find any, but I did manage to find where the old geezer is staying here in Poland. You mean Father General? That's huge news. Who would have guessed my bad habit of snooping around would eventually pay off? Well, and where is he? 
He's in a place called Verisiboria Spile. According to the documents, I found the building was especially made for this purpose of being used as a base of operations for the Corps while they were stationed here. But sadly, that's all I could find in this computer. What sort of information were you looking for? You know, things like persons of interest, associates, the Corps could have had important. Who's helping them take over, and more importantly, concrete proof of everything they've been doing. From the false flag operations to where we are right now. But we know what happened. We can tell everyone what we know, just like we did with you guys. But that won't be enough. Pascal is right. If we want to really stop them, we need something to back up our story. People won't take our word for granted, even if what we're saying is true. Then what should we do? The best thing we can do, the best thing, way to do it is with documents that show the involvement of the core in all of this. And as I said, I can't get anything else from here, but I'm certain that if we go to go to that Varsa or something, we can get any information we can. And with that, we'll stop the core for good. And then, then that's our next move. Let's get out of here and try to find out how to get into that building. Okay. I don't know why you want to go to that building, but so be it. No need to call them again. Okay. Probably safe. Oh no, they're outside rain. Probably safer to not go to that building. Stop right there. Okay, let's do your tag. You're the medic, so attack you first. Ow. Okay, that's fine. Oh no, you evaded, and now step guys turn to attack. Okay, you want to do that like this? Okay, let's do I am. I'm going to do a st uh, smoke grenade on everybody. Actually, let's do a scale attack on. On you in the middle. Okay, man, they evaded. You can be attacked, this person. He's down. Okay. He evaded. That's why I don't want. That's why I need to take out the medics. Um. Okay, make a sound. Okay, that's fine. He just wasted that, that's good. I hope he ba I hope he wasted it. And your turn roof. No, he evaded. Oh no. Okay, let's try this. He's down. We have one down.
Man, I don't know if I'm blind or not. Okay, he's gonna attack now. Ooh, that's fine. Okay. He's been defeated. We're going to take this. Uh, so what do we need to use an IM. Is she? We got healing. We need to use a. This guy, that, and then. So now we're at 197, 209, 94. We'll be fine for the moment, I think. For the moment. Oops. Go through. Go through. Don't keep me waiting. Okay. Go this way now. We're going to push this over. Car through. Let's see if we're probably going to hit some enemies up here. I already know. Cherries, so I see. <laughs> well, let's take gloves. It's a trap door. Wow, it's my first time seeing a server farm from up close. It would look more impressive with the lights off, though. I wonder what they're using all these servers for. Come on, man. Don't stay behind. <laughs> Heavy bulletproof vest. I don't think these cameras are from this facility. TC Proto 338 stock. Looks like I could attach to my sniper rifle, but I've never seen something like this before. So if I go to equip, right? Or go to I M's and I go to wait. Um can I attach stuff? Is that what it's saying I can do? Maybe not. Key items. Um, take this. Nope. Okay, we won't make take that. Okay. Let's look at this. Oh, type ready for testing. Father Juno wanted to have it used in Operation Pergola, so it needs to be taken to him right away. The prototype has been divided in three sections and taken each to secure locations here in Poland. Handle with extreme care. Okay. Are you still looking at this stuff? Come on, man. Don't get too far behind. Is he still with me? Uh, party. Yeah, he's still there. Good. <laughs> okay. Let's go down. We need to go to find the elevator now. Okay. Um, yeah, this way. Go 
go this way. Do do. Let's do. Now we have to run. Let's see if we have to run. Is it this way? I think. I'm pretty sure. Then we have to go up the ladder. Go through the door. Hopefully we don't run into anybody on the way. Go down this way, go up this way, around here, go down here, go to my save point, save the progress, yes, we're saving it here, and then we go up through the store, I'm guessing, I, if I remember right, correct, correctly, gotta go to this keypad, okay, so the person on the radio said the password was dots, but I can only input numbers, so the answer should be dice, D-I-D-I-C-E, I think it's this one, let's see if this works, 4935, the door has been unlocked, perfect. The elevator is now working. Okay, that should do it then. We need to head back to Alvaro and leave. I don't know if this is going to be good or not, but we're going to find out. Okay, let's open this door up. Save your progress. Yes. Yes, sir. Um, progress has been saved. Don't move. Why did you have to step out of the elevator? Like, you could have just let it close on you. Before we do that, let's do an I am. Uh, smoke grenade. On. We'll do it on this elite. On. Yeah, he evaded. She's dead. Um. Man, he has some high defense. Okay, I need to eye him out. I'm going to be, uh, I need it, I need it on myself. Okay. Evaded. It's good. It's good thing we got some health on us. Evaded. Good. Attack. You're the one with attacking. Okay, you're dead. Good. Now. Hold on, I need to AFK for one second. I need to see that. It's like a helicopter going overhead or something. Uh, let's see what's going over right now. Where am I? Am I here? <laughs> Sheriff's department. Go figure. Police department's going over my house. Now we'll open this up. Let's see what says on anything happened on Facebook. Mm. 
don't see nothing. Sorry, I'm just checking to see if I see anything in my town to if there's anything going outside my window. I don't see nothing really to pay attention to. Hmm. We won't worry about it. If we keep hearing it, I'm gonna check again. So yeah. Okay, I need to use an item. On... You're gonna use... We're gonna use cookies for an Arvis. Yeah, that's just... I didn't want that to happen. Oh well. You're our friend, we're gonna kill you now. Take you out. Just you now. Okay. Now we can go. Just what happens is raining too. We should probably find some place to tuck in doors. And stay away from that thing too. Okay, we did stay away from it. Um what, what did she say? Oh god, are we screwed? Relax. I think she's just asking if we're... I just asked if you were alright. Sorry, I didn't mean to scare you. My name is Hannah. Nice to meet you, Hannah. Please ignore what my friend said. Haha. Uh -huh. We are just caught in the rain, that's all. Is that so? It almost looked like you were hiding from that truck. Alright, alright. That truck did star us, but it's not like we did something bad. It's just scary to see so many soldiers around. Yeah, it's sad to see the city like this. I'm guessing you have- you are not from here, right? Cure for you is starting soon, so be careful. Is there a cure for you? Yep. How long do we have left? Um, like, 10 minutes or so? Haha, uh -huh. what did I tell you? We really are screwed. Why? What happens if you miss Kirfu? Can they shoot you? In most cases, they'll take you to the police or something, I think. And ferry. But nobody knows what these soldiers might do. And I sure don't want to find out. She's light. We were talking about the core after all. In any case, if you don't have anywhere to stay, you can come with me for the night. All six of us? In times like these, you can only help each other and stay safe. Hold on. Checking this again. Was this helicopter? It looks like it's so good around my town a bit, and now it's headed back. I don't know what this helicopter is doing, but who knows? Um, don't see nothing. Okay, we're not gonna worry about it. We're going to keep playing this game in the rain. <laughs> Thank you. 
Uh, she doesn't look too thrilled to have us here. Oh, sorry. I should introduce you all. This is my mother. Her name is Cy Cyria. I know I should have asked before bringing people here, but don't worry. You do the right thing, Hannah. Please make yourselves at home. I apologize if I seemed a bit rude. It's just that things have been pretty tense the last few days. It's completely understandable, given the situation. Anyway, you're probably exhausted. I was thinking about letting you use the attic. It's a little cramped, but it's nice and warm. Wait, isn't it like four boxes? Don't worry, we have experience cleaning up messy rooms. In any case, whenever you are ready to go to sleep, you can take boxes from the attic to the shed in the back yard. Yeah, I think we should do that now. You guys look like you really need at rest, especially your friend over there. Okay. Looks like someone spilled coffee on the paper, so it's hard to read. Hmm, I wonder what they're talking about. We left the TV on just to have some sort of background noise. But I can translate what they're saying if you're interested. Yeah, please come translate. Alright, let's see. Naturally, ministries cannot remain vacant, and therefore new ministers will be announced next Monday for a public announcement. We are on a very good track. I am sure these changes will benefit all our 38 million men and women. We are working as hard as possible to restore the peace we all deserve in our dear Poland, the interim Prime Minister said. And that's the end of the note. Let me know if you want me to translate something else. There's a bunch of old books here. The bread looks a bit stale, but I guess it's still edible. There's a bunch of table and dishes. There are several drawers with what I believe is flour, sugar, and rice. The, this old cutting board has seen better days. Oh, this smells nice. Is this some kind of stew? Dishes, dishes. Like dog food or something on the counter, but it's not the table. Um, it's locked. Save your progress? Yes, sir. Your progress has been saved. Can I go in here? It's locked. Can I go in here? Nope. Can I, wait, can I leave the house? Is that an option? I want to see. Before I do anything, can I leave the house? I shouldn't go outside. Nope. I have to stay in the house. Making sure. It's always worth checking. Okay, I'm going to tidy up the stuff in the back to make room. In the meanwhile, you can help me grab those boxes. I'll try, find, I'll try to find some sleeping bags and blankets. They should be around here somewhere. Anyway, let me know when you're ready. I'll help you take them downstairs. I think we're done here. Let's go downstairs. Save my progress once again. Let's go downstairs. Where are we going downstairs? In here? Oh, we have to take them to the shed. That's right. Should we leave the boxes over there? Yeah, just leave them inside the shed. I guess I'll put the boxes down here. I hope they are safe from the rain. 
Let's go inside quickly before we catch a cold. What quest am I doing? Uh, I don't know what quest I'm doing right now, but okay. Let's go back inside. Oh, right. I'll translate for you. That man with the glasses is the Marshal of Sedrum, the lower house of the Parliament. Parliament. Even though these last few days have been very difficult for us as a nation, we're making progress fixing the issues that caused this crisis. As Marshal of Sedrum, I'm calling the National Assembly to meet in 72 hours, where we'll bring the, change, we'll bring the charges against President Roman Quitt to the state of tribunal to be removed from office. Three days? As my role dictates, I'll be taking over the responsibility, responsibilities of the President during impre impeachment proceedings. The Prime Minister and the Cabinet will continue to carry out their responsibilities as usual up until the state tribunal continues with a verdict. And regarding our law enforcement and national security, the Corps will continue to offer support. Why is he with them? Rest assured, we're doing everything in our power to leave this crisis behind us. Good night and long live Poland. This isn't an impeachment. This is a coup. I can't believe they branched us off the government just like that. Mom, wait. Calm down. Did you see him too? I did. It's just like Sergeant Branna said. Father General is making his move and the Corps will most likely take over soon after. He said the assembly would take place in three days. We need to act fast, but how? Rook, we're all exhausted. I doubt there's, so, there's much we can do for now. We should go to rest for the night. Let's plan our next move first thing in the morning, okay? Okay. I think... That should be good for tonight. I'll probably start the f next morning. Next time I play this game. But if this is something you're enjoying, let me know. Let me a follow. Because I'm probably going to play this game tomorrow once again. Now that we're right on track, starting to stream again. But we'll also... Yeah, we'll play again. If you're watching this on YouTube, remember to like the video comment subscribe let me know your favorite part and i'll catch you guys next time thanks for watching everyone i'll catch you soon see you tomorrow